Hi folks, welcome to Rexport Education. I'm Ryan Shanahan and today we're filming on location to introduce you to my new Spotlight series where we highlight alternative athletics in the movement arts. Today's Spotlight series is on pole fitness and behind me we'll be going to the studio in just a moment to introduce you to some of their staff and students as well as my new friend Jenna McNamara, owner and founder of Rockstar Pole Fitness here in Westminster, Colorado. But before that, here's a brief introduction to highlight the athleticism and aesthetic that is pole fitness. Well, let's go check it out. Pole fitness. Pole fitness. Pole fitness. Positive. The community. <laughs> Lift yourself. Become empowered. My name is Mary and I've been pole dancing for about eight years now. <laughs> um, the reason why I love pole dancing is because it's a way I can freely express myself through dance. I've built the self-confidence that I've never had before. There's a mind-body connect that I think so many women struggle with just because of this ideal image that we have in our society. I have come across a lot of men and women who are in all different phases of their life and they come into pole not exactly sure what to expect. The majority of people come um, into class with just some hesitance and then leave class feeling empowered and happy and connected with themselves and others. My name is Amanda Grant. I've been polling since 2010. In the fitness community, there's a saying, girls who lift. Well, in the pole community, I've created a little slogan, and it's girls who lift themselves. Because when you come to pole fitness, you're learning how to literally lift yourself into the air. And the community that you'll find when you get here is just so inspiring. It really boosts your self-confidence. And so figuratively, you end up lifting yourself. Part of what I really enjoy about being an instructor for pole fitness is that many times we just get people who've come off the street and they're really just looking for a way to get into shape. But once they get here and they're surrounded by the inspirational community and the really uplifting environment, they find so much more than fitness. They really find a sense of community, a place to socialize, um, and I've watched people really change their whole self-image from 
just really having no confidence to really just believing in everything that they can do and being so proud of what their body has accomplished. Um, the first time I walked through the doors was three years ago, and it has changed my life all for the better. I not only am in the best shape that I've ever been in, but I have a coven of women who stand by my side. This is not only a workout, this is a beautiful, wonderful community full of laughter and joy. So Rockstar has meant so much more to me than just a, a workout. It's been um, the community. Good. Other direction, lift up, back, drop. Lifts. Lifts. Nice. And back to center with the shoulder. Nice circle. Up. So on top of the incredible workout, you also get this incredible community both in the studio and outside of the studio um, that you just can't find anywhere else and I absolutely love it. My experience with Rockstar has been very positive. I've made a lot of new friends, which I think being closer to 30 is very hard to do. Um, I also like that there's a combination of strength and sexuality in this sport, which I don't think you get with a lot of other sports. So if you're thinking about trying it out, I definitely think you should. So pole dancing is for absolutely anybody. We have students that come in that are athletic and work out every day to students that haven't worked out in years. Both these students are successful in pole and um, they both really enjoyed at Rockstar. <laughs> So pole dancing is challenging and I think that's why we love it so much. At Rockstar, classes are structured in a way to where you progressively build strength um, in a safe manner so you learn tricks and spins progressively. This will make you a well-rounded pole dancer and help prevent injury. So everyone progresses at a different pace in pole. One student may stay in level one for a month while another student may stay in there for a year. I think it's just important to focus on your own pole journey and enjoy the process while you do it. It is a sport, so it takes time to get good, but it's fun while you do it. So pole dancing is for women and men. We definitely have more women at the studio, but we do have some badass men who come and who are members. I always encourage men to try it because it is beneficial for everybody. So at Rockstar, we have students of all different body types. Um, if you are overweight, please don't let that deter you from trying a pole class. Um, 
Our polls will support you and so will we. Um, we have a very supportive community and we welcome everybody who comes into the doors. So I think that pole dancing is one of the best fitness activities that you can do to help overcome body images. I see students build confidence every class that they come and they start to feel comfortable in their own skin. Uh, pole dancing redirects energy from what your body looks like to um, what it can do and I think that's a really um, healthy mindset for fitness. So you can compete in pole dancing. There are hundreds of competitions all over the world, um, too many to name. We have one coming up in Colorado called Colorado Pole Championship. Um, it's a really amazing event and we have some rock stars who are competing in it as well. So at Rockstar we have a ton of other classes besides pole classes and we highly suggest that you take those along with pole. So we have strength classes, inversion classes, uh, boot camp, um, flexibility and these are all uh, there to help you become a more well-rounded pole dancer and help you prevent injury as well. So a typical pole class, um, what that looks like is we start with a warm-up to begin with. That can be on or off the pole. Then we move on to tricks and spins depending on which uh, level it is. Um, at, every, at the end of every class, we end with a free dance, and this is for students to explore their movement and um, combos together from, from class. Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching this episode of Rexport Education, highlighting our Spotlight series. Let me know what other athletic activities you'd like to see a spotlight on. And also, thank you so much for supporting this channel by hitting that like button and subscribing for future updates. More on the way in the future. Until then, stay active.